Well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to a 41 degree Wednesday. Is that right? Yeah, Wednesday, the 22nd of uh, November. We're off to the off to the hills. God, it feels like a spring morning at 41 degrees. Feels fantastic out here. Smells like, or smells, it does smell, but it feels like springtime out there. Yeah. It's shockingly warm after the last few few mornings. I know it. All right, let's head south. All right. All right. Little woman, this is almost like a Friday, but it's only yeah. for one day off. It's a Thanksgiving Eve, and uh, pouring down rain here in Vancouver, actually, just a little bit after we got on the freeway it's been dumping ever yeah. since but uh anyway <laughs> hey have a good day there little You're woman so all right uh, see you bye I love you. so i'm finding things here off and on here number one look at this more robust skid pan look how it's all formed around that's nice so it's got a different skid pan and uh, as soon as i pop the seat off I was greeted, if you guys are familiar with these, they had those goofy inline, make sure I'm pointing the camera, inline fuses that were embedded in a harness that ran around here. Now, it's a fuse block. And then this big loom right here, um, where you put the pro chip in, this is, this is something you gotta order. This is, allows you to have the ABS Pro, Dynamic Pro, Enduro Pro, all these cool things, that's the chip. Well, it used to zip tie into this loom right here. Look at this, it's got a nice, neat little home. There's the little blind plug so you don't get dirt in it. But you plug the chip in and it's got this little holder right there. That is super nice, real nice. But uh, what was the other thing? No, I guess that's the same. I was thinking the framework was a little different in there. But um, yeah, finding little things, but very important things the dme or the ecu and the rest of the world looks like the couplers are, are more robust but i love this nice clean look underneath here oh, that's nice real nice all right let me uh continue on i want to bust get this thing together right quick if i get a dry moment out there which it doesn't look like it's going to happen i'll take her for a rip it hasn't stopped pouring since i got here so I don't think it's going to happen, but they're probably going to want this thing on the floor ASAP. Hardly anybody even knows it's here. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Only you and I know. Here she is, all assembled. Definitely a, a difference in the pan, in the belly pan. And I've noticed that the exhaust seems like it's tucked maybe a little tighter. Instead of the O2 sensor being back here on the header, it's right next to the head on both sides. And the crossover tube is like facing forward more. I'll give you an example. There's where the O2 sensors have been since 13. And you can see the crossover tube just kind of goes straight across. This one kind of goes forward slightly. Yeah, buddy. There she is, all assembled and ready to ride. Haven't even fired the thing up yet. I guess the motor sounds different. The valve train and all the cam gear stuff is supposed to be quieter, they're saying. That's what we're talking they were talking about at school anyway. We'll see you here in a moment. Well <laughs> should be enough gas to fire it. I can usually get upstairs with it. Low fuel. Come on, I said cancel. Here we go. First sound of a cloak. Whoa. The top end's definitely quieter. Wow. That doesn't have the typical water box or clitter clatter. Whoa. That is noticeably quieter on the top end. Holy moly. Ooh, it has a different sound. The exhaust note is slightly different. 
wow them heads are like super quiet that's crazy all right let me get her up there and get some gas in her right quick it's not completely dry out there but it's not raining either just riding this thing upstairs the bottom end torque and that whisper almost Japanese sounding motor is just way cool if you blip the throttle you can actually hear the the click of the camshift this thing is way cool an old BMW she just don't doubt them folks for not one second Get my shield down here I know this is muffled sounding but this uh, climb helmet is uh, kind of loud. Oops, that's not going to work. It's going to have to be cracked a little bit. I'm sorry. <laughs> These fresh tires on the damp road kind of swooped me a little bit. Holy moly. I'm here to tell you there is a huge difference. Wow. That's like, that's like a big difference. Oh yeah, it's even got some more diesel compression than it had before. Oh man! Oh my lord, the difference is shocking. Holy moly! Oh man, this is going to be one of those, don't ride one of the new ones. If you have an old one, stay away. Or you can be rolling out with one. Wow, that's crazy. That thing, it has like a build to it. Like it's gaining power as you, you know what I mean? Like it's got like it's got a lot of top end. It's not quite so linear. I mean, it pulls really hard down low and then it just like peaks. It starts rising and you feel it pulling really, really hard. It's like riding a crotch rocket or something with a bunch of torque down low. That is crazy. Oh, and it just, there's like no flat spots, nothing. It just pulls from the grunt. We got to do a little outside walk around. Can't, can't get away without not out uh, doing a walk around. Oh, man. I'm so used to the leaves being in the trees there. I looked over there. I like, oh, somebody got the trees down. <laughs> There's just no leaves in them. Um, something tells me that one got abandoned. What do you think? Ah, we got somebody sitting there. Let's, we'll do it from a, from a different spot today. Get you in some of these beautiful leaves in here. Let's just back her in. I can't believe how different that sounds. Man, definitely how it performs that is like a whole new class of boxer right there listen how different that thing sounds but yet it's still got the boxer exhaust note though it seems deeper Wow, I am like super, super, super impressed. Seems like it idles lower too. Is it idle lower? Thousand RPMs. Seems like they idled faster than that. Oh, it sounds so good. Oh, and the power is nuts. Oh, that's way addicting. That's really addicting. Oh man, I love that. Just feel that. Like, hold on, mama. Oh, she's sweet. Come on, GSAs. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna avoid as long as I can and wait till the 1250 GSA comes out. 
instead of the GS, I just uh, like me like myself some GSA. <laughs> That's insanely cool. Oh, that is way cool. And there's this like a buildup of a whirring sound too. The when you roll on. It's amazing how different everything sounds. I seen that white car come rush up behind me. I thought, uh oh. <laughs> the law man done found me. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting front wheel to come off the ground so easy. That actually startled me. Yeah, I'm going to take one lap try to dry the tires off where I go across the BMW floor. This thing runs. This thing runs so much better. That's one pretty Indian right there too. The heck's my kid got going on with this mule? Listen, the fans even got a different sound. It's still single-sided fan. You guys can... Where's Mike at? He's gonna freak when he sees this thing. Nobody even knew it was here. That's way cool. Park it up here and find a puck. This is the new 1250. Oh man. This thing's a game changer. I mean it, the power, the sound. Zero. This is the only one. <laughs> no discount. Hey man, it's like a sport bike. You know, they they kind of had this like a linear power, and now it's like whoa, it, it whoo. It's like yeah. And there's this cool kind of a whirring, you know, like a Japanese sport bike. I love that whirring sound. It is sick. Yeah. It's only like 11 or 12 more horsepower, but it feels way different. Yeah, I took it for a quickie. It's very, very, very impressive. The top end's really quiet. It's not, you know, clattery, clattery anymore, which is not a fault. It's just the way they sounded. But the power is nuts. And it does like a sport bike. It, it, the power revs up as you're going. Wow! They never did that before. Yeah, and that variable cam timing, and oh man, it's crazy. No, this is not. I guess Travis says we have two standards and a low on their way. This is the only one that's shown up. And this is a comfort package. It's not a exclusive. Just a comfort package with the seats and the colors and whatnot. That thing is super, super impressive. I was not expecting that. No, I just put it in Dynamic Pro and... Man, it is super, super nice. <laughs> Man, I just rode this 2018 our 1200 GS, oddly enough, the same color and everything as the 1250. Man, the difference is amazing. This is literally gonna be one of those the 990, 998 CC V twin versus the 1330 triple in the spiders. If you love your 1200, don't ride a 1250. I'm gonna warn you, just like I was warning the people few years back when it came out with that 1330 
stay off the 1330s if you like your 990 or 991 V twin. Uh, the difference between the 1200 and the 1250 is like night and day. It's pretty shocking. Just the motor sound. Oh man, they run. Man, the technical, you know, the specs, the horsepower and torque difference between the two just don't. Just That's why you just throw the specs out the window and go ride the thing. Because uh, the number of difference doesn't match how it feels. And that was a brand new bike that I can't really get on. So imagine what it's like when it's broken and you can flog dog it. That's going to be a fun, fun bike, those 1250s. Man, BMW, you guys just keep knocking it out of the park. All right, it's almost time to go. Turkey day tomorrow. Hot day. Well, until Friday, we're done. Still not raining out here. I won't complain about that one freaking hot odor. Old woman, you want to head home and prepare for turkey day tomorrow? Yep. <laughs> Things to do, places to go. Yeah. Everything's wet, but it's not raining. And that's just fine with me. Which is good. Hit the old Wally World. Had to uh, grab some stuff for uh, Thanksgiving. We're doing it up at Kelly's dad and everybody participates a little bit. So that's our that's our part in it. Well hello there YouTube. How the heck is everybody's Wednesday going? Wednesday. Your hands are cold. Yeah, my hands are cold. I don't know why. I've kinda had a cold oh. chill on the way home for some reason. Even turned Probably the heater up in here. That's really rare. One <laughs> little degree. Yeah. So you gotta turn on the low heated seats. No, I'm not that cold. Oh, oh yeah, it is. That thing make me go to sleep or something. That's too no, much. No, that's too much heat. <laughs> <laughs> but I hope you guys had a wonderful day, and you guys that have Thanksgiving here in the states, I hope you have a wonderful Turkey Day tomorrow. Yeah. Don't eat too much. All that kind of good jazz. All the. Oh yeah, enjoy all the yeah. family, friends. You always and try to food. get a little bit of everything because you know everybody has their own little input. You know, so you, well, you got to make sure you try everything. Yeah. You start off this little plate. Ooh. Next thing you know, you're, oh. I know it. It's amazing how fast you can get full. Oh yeah. You know you're starving and you barely get anything ate, and now you're just stuck. Yep. Now you're wasted. Yep. You're all done for. Heck yeah. It's fun. It gets yeah. everybody together. It's always a good time. Oh yeah. yeah. Catch up time. Yep. Yeah. Hear all the crazy stories. <laughs> oh yeah. It'll be good. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I mean, I was so excited about riding that 1250. I, I was really thinking about how the motor sounded and all that stuff. I was just not even thinking about the performance being better to how I rode that thing. That is super, super impressive. That's crazy. Wow. Can't go on enough about that thing. Come on, GSA, BMW. Start sending them out. Yep. That's Hubba like that. Yeah, I think it's really nice. It's going to yeah. be hard not. Sure is pretty. Yeah. The, it's made, the GSA is going to have the most different look than, mm. than that one. Of course, that one's like a, a color that they've been using, you know, since last year, maybe even before. So it doesn't have that impact of being so new. Right. You know, I noticed the head, the valve covers like immediately, uh -huh. whoa, that's like way different. Mm-hmm. Anyway, we got frozables, all kinds of stuff back there. We need to roll on in. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke tent, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And I hope your Thanksgiving or Friday are wonderful. Thank you. Yes. All right. Till tomorrow. Guys, you guys take care. <laughs> we'll see you now. <laughs> bye. Bye-bye.